Hey guys, this is Jason Goldberg and I'm here today to give you one of the lies, myths, and misunderstandings that we live by is that transformation has to be hard. That it has to be some big over the top thing where you destroy one thing to create another and that isn't the way it has to be. Just last week I was talking to a client and we were talking about his transformation. He wanted to go from being this person that's super analytical, that always leads with his head and has troubles getting into his heart and being more creative and kind of slowing down and, and just being relaxed in the process. And what he said really got me thinking. He said, man, this is gonna be tough, Jason. It's like tearing down a building that's been there for my entire life and rebuilding a brand new building brick by brick by brick. And so in that moment, I had this idea, this thing came to me and I said, hey man, are you open to looking at this in a slightly different way? And he said, yeah, of course. And I said, okay, what if instead of thinking about tearing down a building, destroying a building and having to rebuild it from scratch with the same bricks and having this heavy, long-term, big transformation happen, what if it was simpler? What if it was like you've had this car your entire life? This car that you've loved and has treated you so well and it's gotten you from A to B to C to D, you get a new car. And that car is the exact same make and model as the car you've already had. You're used to the radio, the seats are comfy like you remember, but one thing has changed. The gas tank has moved from the driver's side to the passenger side of the car. So what do you think that means? Inevitably, you go to the gas station and because you've been programmed from using your other car your entire life, you pull up to the gas tank and you do it where the gas tank is on the driver's side. So you get out of the car, you see, oh, th the gas tank's not here anymore. The gas tank's on the other side. Is that a big deal? Is that heavy? Is that pressure filled? Does that make you feel like a loser? Of course not. You simply back the car out, turn it around, pull in so it's on the passenger side, put gas in your car and you go on your way. You would never say to yourself, oh, I'm such a loser. I can't believe that after all these years, I couldn't just on a dime remember that the gas tank had switched to the other side and get it on my first try. And that's the way transformation is, guys. When you're transforming and, and wanting to be somebody new, create a new way of being, test out new ways of thinking and seeing the world, it's okay if you revert back to some old conditioning, some old programming. Just like if you get out of the car and you see that the gas tank is not on the side that you remember, you can say, oh, yeah, I remember. So I'm gonna get gas today, I'm gonna be gentle on myself, I'm not gonna beat myself up, and I'll remember next time, hopefully when I get gas, that it's on the passenger side instead of the driver's side. So if you know somebody in your world that really is focused on transforming, they're doing the work to become a better version of themselves, to release old programming and, and bring in new, more empowering things that serve them in their life, but you see them being really hard on themselves, share this video with them. Having a level of awareness and a level of gentleness as we go through the process of transformation is what makes transformation really stick.